Good morning, thanks for joining me. I hope everybody's well and having a good week. Today I have for you a Pure Plus haul. Um, Pure Plus, for anybody who doesn't know, is a small, independent, UK, plus size ladies clothing brand and they have some really lovely bits and pieces. I've got a lot of their clothes in my wardrobe. They do they do sort of a Largan looky style, I would say, and I really like the quality of their clothes as well. Just to let you know, these clothes were gifted for the purposes of me showing them to you. Um, I have not paid for them, but of course I will be honest about my opinions of them as ever. Um, for anybody new around here, I'm five foot three, I'm 56 years old, I'm approximately a size 24 on the top and approximately a size 20 on the bottom. Pure Plus has limited sizing. They go from about a 14 to 16, I think, right up to a 30, 32-ish, I think I'm right in saying. A lot of their stuff comes in at two sizes. It comes um, in one size for this, um, the, the bottom of the size range and another size for the top end of the size range. Everything I'm showing you today, if it's not a one size item, it comes in the smaller size of, of the two, um, which I think goes up to about 22. Just for reference, um, what else do I need to say? I've also got a discount code for Pure Plus, 10% off across the whole website. So I'll put a link to the website down there and also the discount code. So do use that because we love a discount code, don't we? If we can get a bit of money off, that's always a good thing. <laughs> Right, without further ado, let's get into it. And the first item I have chosen is these cargo trousers, cargo magic trousers. They call their trousers magic trousers. And I have two pairs of them already, just the plain magic trousers. I really like them. They're so comfy. They're nice quality. Um, the fabric's good. They wash really well. So I thought I would dip my toe into the cargo trousers. Now, anyone who watches me regularly, I can hear myself speaking really fast. I do this when I have a lot on and I do it without thinking about it so I will attempt to slow down. Slow down Caroline. Anyone who watches me regularly will know that I am not really a fan of the cargo trousers but they are so fashionable again that I keep trying to sort of dip my foot back or toe back into the water and I thought these were good because they're straight leg and they looked fairly flat on the model here rather not rather than bulking out I thought I'd give them a go and see what I thought so got those to try on they've got pockets two lots of pockets if you count the ones on the side and I'm going to pop those on with this top, which is just a very simple green, green? No, it's grey, Caroline. Grey, sort of v-neck. I don't, I want to call it a sweater, but it's not quite a sweater. It's super soft. It is a knit. It's sort of like a sweatshirt material, but a lot thinner but thicker than a t-shirt. It's a nice autumn sort of weight. You know, it's got a little bit of weight to it, but not too much. And I feel like this, the two of these, the trousers and the top will make a really nice casual sort of everyday outfit for autumn. So let's give them a go. I think I've found a pair of cargo trousers I can get on board with. Really pleased with these. So I've got a label on my neck. Whole outfit I really like is just a really nice casual everyday outfit. This is super soft, it's loose fit, it skims over everything, it feels lovely quality. All of Pure Plus's stuff I found washes really nicely. Um, Carla was mentioning and she did a cup, um, Pure Plus video last week and she mentioned that um, everything tumble dries nicely as well. I don't use my tumble dryer that much but um, that might be useful to know for those of you who do. My favourite though, love the top but I love the trousers. I've got them on just turned up a little bit. They are full length as you can see. I've just folded them up because I've got them on with trainers just to make them a little bit cropped. But you can wear them full length of course with boots as winter comes. But I really like the pockets just sit really nice and flat and are quite unobtrusive. They're not bulking out at the sides because as a plus size lady I don't want too much bulking out going on. Trousers are super comfortable. They have a elasticated waist with a tie there. I haven't got it tied up, tied up actually. But um, yeah, elasticated waist. The fabric is really nice. It's got a little bit of slip to it and some stretch. So it's super comfy. It's, honestly, it's like wearing joggers really. But um, yeah, very nice outfit. Love it, great start. Next, I decided to order the Magic Jeggings. These are a lightweight, 
very stretchy denim um they're skinny obviously jeggings are skinny aren't they um they're, they're slightly lighter weight than i was thinking they would be they're if you know the marks and spencers holdy and e jeggings of dreams that i talk about a lot i would say they're slightly lighter weight than that so they're great for autumn possibly a little bit on the lightweight side for winter but we shall see when i've got them on they look very comfy they've got pockets which a lot of jeggings don't have have do they so that's a nice touch and then i'm going to put those on with this top now i know that in carla's video last week if you watch carla's channel carla jenkins um she showed you this very top but in the gray colorway i forgot to say actually that most things come in lots of different colors which is always nice um yeah carla showed this in either a charcoal gray or a black i can't remember but i've got it in the navy so we both have very similar taste um, but this is a really nice top it's a loose fit tunic beautiful quality cotton jersey it has the contrast fabric on the bottom it's got a slightly asymmetric hem I'll pop the picturing so you can see it anyway this I would say is sort of lightweight sweatshirt weight this is another hit another nice simple everyday slightly smarter this outfit I would say um, than the first one also winner the top has got pockets in which i didn't realize to start with and um, the top is pretty oversized but i like that if you're not an oversized person this might not be one for you i mean oversized in terms of what you like for your clothing not oversizing as in body image weight whatever just to make that clear i really like this i love the contrast fabric on the hem and i like the fact it has this asymmetric detail i think that just gives it a little bit of extra shape and interest um the sleeves are long i've rolled them back a couple of times to make them a little bit shorter they don't have cuffs so they are a little bit loose full length but they seem to stay back because it's cotton fabric they said they stay back nicely once you fold them back um, feel like that skims over everything it should do in a very nice way i like the navy color now let's talk about the jeggings they are quite lightweight i feel like in winter they might be just a tiny bit too lightweight for me but shape wise this is the beauty of being plus size and buying from a plus size specific brand they are not tight around my knees there is fabric to spare they are loose around my ankles although they are very much a slim leg trouser they're not super skinny all the way down which is perfect I really really like the shape it's so flattering I, I really like it I feel very confident and I feel quite nice in them as well and as you know as a plus size woman it's nice to put something on and feel nice in it not feel like you're just settling both these outfits I've put on and I felt nice in and that's winning at life isn't it I don't know why I'm talking to you bending down like that. <laughs> Let's put the camera back up. Right, the final item I have to show you today is this, which is somewhere in between a dress and a long tunic top. This is sweatshirt weight material and feels sweatshirty. It's got buttons down the side, which I like. It's got a three quarters sleeve and I really like the color. It does come in other colors, but I liked this khaki. I feel like I'm in a very muted color palette this season. I don't know why. I'm usually quite into my bright colors, but I would definitely for this haul particularly, and my last Marks and Spencer's one, I feel like I've chosen quite a lot of muted colors. But um, I envisioned this on with leggings and little ballet flats possibly, or with boots as we go into winter. Thought this would be a really nice sort of throw on dress, or even with knee high boots and chunk, depending on how long it comes on me. Um, knee high boots, chunky cardigan, and, um, and thick black tights. Okay, this has pockets, it comes down just about on my knee which is good for me that works well um, i've got it on just with the jeans or jeggings that i had on at the beginning and trainers um, however i think because of the length and because of my height i would definitely wear this as a dress with tights rather than with trousers i think it drowns me a little bit in terms of the length with trousers i love the actual quality of it the feel of it feels really nice it hangs nicely it's one of these balloon shaped dresses it comes out a little bit around the hips and i don't always like that look on me 
However, I think once I've got rid of the bulky jeggings underneath and got tights on instead, I feel like it will work a little bit better on me and I'll, I'll feel more comfortable in it. Definitely lovely quality again, I'm sure it will wash well. And you could layer it up, of course, with a cardigan in the winter. Well, that brings us to the end of today's haul. It was a successful one, I think. As I said, I'll put the link to the website below. I'll also pop the discount code down there for 10% off across the site. Thank you to Pure Plus for sending the clothes over. It's always a pleasure to get the opportunity to work with a smaller UK-based business. Always appreciate that. So, um, and, and I love their clothes. So what's not to like, really? I hope you've enjoyed this. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.